it's Ms. Keating. I am the college advisor here at Mooresville High School, which I know sounds very far off as you're just starting your, out your freshman year, but it's never too early to start thinking about your plans after graduation and kind of getting yourself prepped and in the best position possible. Basically, at this point in high school, what you're going to want to do is just make the most of your high school experience. We offer a ton of opportunities, clubs, and really great programs here at the high school. So taking advantage of those is gonna really pay off down the road and kind of helping you figure out what you wanna do and what life after high school holds. Um, that being said, now's a really good time to focus on your study habits and study techniques. Um, a lot of students really struggle in their freshman year getting used to high school. So if you're having a hard time adjusting to that high school um, coursework, make sure you're reaching out to your teachers, counselors, parents, tutoring, anyone that can help you. It's getting a strong foundation of like, how to study, how to take notes, and how to um, do well in your classes is a skill that's going to pay off through all of high school, all of college, and for the rest of your life. Additionally, I would say the biggest thing that I hear from seniors is I wish I had tried harder my freshman year because I didn't realize that it actually mattered. Um, your freshman year, you're starting off with a completely blank GPA. What you do this semester is going to completely set, is going to set the tone of where your GPA is starting off at. The earlier you are in high school, the easier or the more fluctuations you have within your GPA. And once you get to senior year, it's a lot harder to kind of move the needle if your, your GPA isn't where you want it to be. Um, so getting off on the right foot is something that's going to set you up and make your life easier in the long run. Also, like taking advantage of opportunities, whether that's like elective classes that you're interested in, um, CTE classes that you think sound really fun and that um, you would be interested in as a career path is a great option to kind of explore your interests. As are being involved in clubs, um, whether that's uh, sports and athletics, community service, uh, volunteer organizations, or um, academic organizations, getting involved in the organizations at the school is going to really boost your extracurricular involvement, help you make new friends, and look great on your college applications once that comes way down the line. Um, but there's a lot of immediate impacts as well. Now being said, if there's something you're really interested in and wanting to do, you can also go ahead and start a club with some friends and um, getting a faculty advisor. If you have any questions about college, you're welcome to come and see me, even though it's pretty early in the process. And um, my office is in the Counseling Center. You can come through the main office and you can make an appointment at this link um, here and come and see me. By earning industry standard certifications while you're in high school, you give yourself a professional edge. You set yourself apart and prove that you are the best candidate for the job. Most certifications cost a lot of money every time you take the test. While you're in high school, these tests are paid for by the CTAE department. By passing these certifications, there is a possibility of an increase in pay. The more you earn, the more marketable you will be after high school. Please check out all the certifications available here at MHS. Alright guys, I'm going to tell you how to um, order a transcript or if you want to see your GPA, whether you're in 9th, 10th, 11th, or 12th grade, you can pull up your transcript and see your GPA. Ninth graders, you don't have a GPA yet, so um, after the first semester, after December, you will have one, so you can check after that. Um, to get to your transcript, you go to our high school website, uh, Marshall High School. Um, when you get there, you go under departments, you can either go to counseling, or you can scroll down a little bit and go to the Counseling Department link, click on that, and the first thing that'll come up on that website, it'll say, order a transcript now. Um, once you click on that, it'll take you to the Parchment website. Make sure you don't go to www.parchment.com because that'll take you to a different portal. You wanna go to the Mooresville High School portal. Um, once you click on the transcript, go to New Learner Account and start setting up your account. Make sure um, that you use your personal email address because when you graduate, if you're a senior, once you graduate, you still want to have access to your transcripts. Um, and for 9 through 12, the transcripts are free. 
Student athletes, did you know that if you plan to participate in a sport in college, the only grades that your college recruiter will look at are English, math, science, social studies, and your world language grade. Literally, it doesn't matter what your GPA is on your transcript. That recruiting coach calculates a brand new GPA that's usually an entire point lower than what your transcript grade is. It's called your core GPA. Our school has purchased a program called Core CoreCourseGPA.com and we have a special code that you can get from your coach or Mr. Hopkins or your school counselor. This code will allow you to enter your core courses from your transcript, calculate your own core GPA, and generate a PDF that you can share with any recruiting coach to help you look like a more attractive athlete. Visit MyCoreGPA.com and contact your counselor to get the special login code today. Hey ladies and gentlemen, my name is Sergeant Staley, I'm with the North Carolina National Guard. Um, I'm here to talk to you guys today about some opportunities throughout the National Guard with education and opportunities later on in life. Uh, some of the opportunities that we have available are getting your college paid for, uh, we have state tuition, federal tuition, and a couple other things that can help you out. Um, you can go to a school like UNC Chapel Hill that you can have 100% paid for. Um, so you can go to a prestigious college, uh, be able to have your college paid for, be able to get that degree that you want later on in life, and be able to roll through life as you want to. Um, a couple other things that we have, we have job opportunities going throughout the National Guard. We have a hundred different job opportunities for you. Um, you can enlist as a junior, at least 17 years old as a junior in high school, or a senior in high school, but you have to be at least 17 years old with parental consent. Um, some of the opportunities that we have, we, we have doctors, nurses, uh, mechanics, engineers, you, you name it, we have it. Uh, we have 100 different jobs throughout North Carolina itself. Um, if you're interested, feel free to give me a call. My number is 704-773-8881. Uh, you can shoot me a text or give me a call and I'll be more than happy to answer any questions that you have.